Delicious, guys. Jerk Off with a capital J-E-R-K-E-O. They're Jerk Off. Jer you know what I mean. That was my best friend on the telephone. We're going on vacation together. But before we go on vacation, I have to have a little chat with all y'all out there. I just came back from getting a $15 bikini wax. First of all, I'll say you get what you paid for because what's left of my hair down there now looks like a confused topiary. Bikini waxing is straight up torture. It had been a really long time. And the thing is like, when the wax goes on, it feels like really, really nice and warm, but you know it's coming, so you're like, oh God, it's going to And let me tell you, this little lady, she took her sweet ass time. It hurt so badly. I'm not even a bitch when it comes to pain. This light bulb went on of being like, what the hell are we doing as a society that this is normal? I'm not some kind of crazy feminazi psychopath. I'm not walking around here with like a foxy Cleopatra afro hanging out in my pants, all right? With that said, the practice of bikini waxing is so ridiculous it's hard for me to imagine that people do it all the time. Who are you really doing it for? Really. We're supposed to be pretty much as hairless as possible. I'll tell you where you should have all your hair is on the top of your head. Other than that, you want to go ahead and get rid of everything else so that you're just silky smooth. Why? For the man. I would just like any males who are watching this to imagine what it would be like to be in a room with another man uh, who has a popsicle stick, a hot bowl of wax, and some strips of linen. And he's gonna popsicle stick hot wax onto your ball sack and then rip it off and he's gonna do this over and over again until it's all gone. Go ahead. I'll wait. And that's just the beginning. Then comes like the irritation and the bumps and the burn and the ingrown hairs. This is normal? This is about as normal as going somewhere and having all of your toenails pulled out. And then I read this article in a magazine the other day about this woman who had had all of her pubic hair lasered off, and then she met this guy who had a bush fetish, and this bitch got put Rogaine on her vagina to try and regrow the hair, and she got eyelash extensions put on. And this was supposed to be like a heartwarming tale of a girl coming into her own and wanting to be accepted. I mean, come on really really silly that people do these things because we've been indoctrinated from a very early age to care very much about what other people think about us especially members of the opposite sex it's very very important in a previous video I said that if a guy doesn't like you with cellulite then he doesn't like you at all I'm gonna say that again here if a guy doesn't like you with pubic hair then that guy doesn't like you at all I think if it wasn't called bikini waxing I think if it we had to ask for it like I want someone to painfully rip out all of my pubic hair it might not be as popular. This video is probably long enough. I've probably got like enough stuff going on. And I'm sorry that I've been slacking on the upload department, but I will be picking it back up shortly. I have lots of great video ideas that I want to do. I have to go finish packing now, and then I'm going on vacay. I see ya!